How you doing today? Welcome to the Pilsen Show, eh? Friggin' right, boys. We're camping, so I'm kind of low-key right now. Friggin' right, I am. But I'm gonna take this X-Max out for a rip, I am. See if you can't break something. Why wouldn't we? We got a little sticky in the tire. Hear it? What in the f Where's that going? Oh! What? Jumper? You know how hard that's gonna be to hit? It's not a very big area to hit. Boys, girls, peoples. Oh boy, I just want to see my line. Okay, where's my line? Just give it a flippy flippy. Uh, oh, sorry, bud. I didn't get you, did I? Come on, you old fucking bag. Get the fuck going. It is. Won't be in a minute if she don't get going. Oh, decent. Put her in a tree, boys. <laughs> oh yeah, brother. Oh, oh it's so hard to hit. It's so small. Careful. How am I going to do this without killing myself? Uh-oh. Oh, careful. Billy's just ruining shit. You hit the face so hard. It is a little too steep, eh? A little wash off. I fixed up him. I gotta fix this, eh? He wants to keep crawling forward on me. Oh, yeah, we did. There you go, boys. We'll get back to her later, we will. We got some other stuff to bring out. Friggin' right, we do. Well, I'm just working on the old axial over here, on the old trailer hitch, and Steve's over here playing with Sean's friggin' excavator. Excavator? Excavator. Excavator. Look at that thing, boys. Girls, peoples. Make sure you subscribe and like if you like this kind of stuff, eh? Why wouldn't you? That's pretty cool. Sean's got pretty carried away with the homemade remote, though, boys. Check out that thing. Hey, look at it. What's really going on? <laughs> she work just like the real thing, Stevie? Well, I don't know. I don't run excavators, but it sure seems to work like a real thing. That's a pretty cool remote right there, I'll tell you. Hey. What do you make it? A crick? Yeah, I'm trying to get drain all this water out of here. Decent. Decent. Hey, this is where it got stuck earlier, boys. Then all dirty done. That's freaking cool. Oh boys, what we have going on here is we have a little bit of a loose rear end we do. Everything's loose here, so we're gonna tighten up some things, add a couple screws, and hopefully uh, be able to get some somewhere on this thing, eh? This screw's loose, I'll tell you that right now. Big time. Friggin' right it was. That will help, hey? Eh? Oh yeah, decent. Frustration, can you feel the frustration from the water? For fuck's sakes. And then stay out of the puddle. She's missing a few screws, she was. You lose your buckets over there? How long did the batteries last on that, Sean? Long time. Here we go, boys. All tweaked up. Feel a little solider now, eh?
Yeah, you did. So you can actually dig right between the tracks if you're careful. What do you think of that, boys? Make sure you leave your like and your comments below if you like that shit. Freaking right, you better. Oh, boys and girls, a good weekend of camping it was. A little bit of a mud hole. Hey, just finished cleaning the shitter out, boys. Freaking right, it did. They gave it the old dumperuski. But uh, hopefully I get some footage on this old camera here of some RC stuff I do for you. So we'll have to see what happens. Freaking right, we will. When I'm gonna go home, I'm gonna get out the power washer. I'm gonna power wash a trailer. Power wash this and that, the other thing, and maybe work on the RC track for a little bit. I'll tell you one thing, man. This trailer pulls like a dream with the old Silverado. I'm doing 100 clicks right now. I don't even know what's there, boys. She pulls her like a dream, she does. <clears throat> no way fisting on the old Safari, boys. She's cruising in the old Silverado. Gotta adjust the trailer brakes so they don't seem to be grabbing as much as I want them to. They are definitely working, but not very good. But well, here we go, boys. Zero to 60, eh? Go zero to 60 with a 32 foot trailer behind me. There's 60, boys. That's pretty freaking decent, eh? Okay? Freaking right it is. 80. Oh, I'm in the 70. You better slow down, boys. Well, boys, I'm home. Freaking right I am. Had a good time camping, we did. Bunch of good friends there. Got the uh, crawlers all washed up for the old course out back. We're going to take that out for a little rip ski. Freaking wash the trailer because it was messy as hell it was. And I washed the old Silverado. Hey, I gotta get on the old Silverado and get the rust fixed on her, I do. A couple little bubs starting down here, I do, boys, and I wanna get that on that before it's too late. And I got a, I got a little bub starting right here, which is from me, from taking the goddamn molding off. Cocked it right over, I did. And I wanna get these box sides done, because unacceptable. Unacceptable, boys. I don't like that crap. I don't like rust, I hate rust. But she was a mud hole camping this weekend, boys. So I had a power wash the trailer, power wash the truck, power wash the mats, power wash the chairs, power, power, power wash. Look at all the carpets I power wash. Holy. But anyways, I'm really tired and I think I'm gonna go in and have a nice little shower, hot shower, boys. Chill back, do a little bit of editing for you guys. And uh, we're gonna get on to the old freaking RC rock crawling track we are. Cause I wanna get working on that. I don't go camp for another couple weeks now, at least a couple weeks, boys. So when I get back on that over there, I like to put a couple guide wires and then you can drive around the gazebo, put a couple guide wires once I get the roof done, which should be soon, eh? Just talked to a guy on the weekend I did that might come over and do that for me. But I got a sore throat. I don't know if it's from the fire or from catching Melanie's cold. So I'm just gonna take her easy. Like I said, have a shower, do some editing, give you guys something to watch. Hey, why wouldn't I? But anyways, thanks for subscribing. Thanks for liking. As always, welcome new, any new subscribers. Love you guys. Freaking right I do. And uh, please share. Hey, please share the videos, boys. Try to get me up over the 4,000 mark. Why wouldn't you? Hey, that'd be decent, boys. Gotta get the pool ready soon, too, we do. Freaking right we do. But anyways, hopefully everybody has a good day and had a good weekend like I did. And stayed pretty busy, boys. The busier you stay in life, the better you'll feel. Right? It's true. If you lay around and do nothing, you get all depressed and shit and whatnot. So keep busy, stay healthy, and uh, you know what to do for now.